Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights That's it, that is the Black Rock Canyon Trail. From here you can do the panorama loop as you guys saw, or you can take that and then go on to another trail that's Warren Peak. For today we're stopping here. It's been a long day and uh, wanna head back and relax a little bit. So, beautiful trail. This is by far, I think, the prettiest trail we've done here at Joshua Tree. Let's go. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is a little bit different. I uploaded two different trail videos, very short trails, so I figured I'd mash them up into one day. So if you haven't already, make sure you check out the Minerva Hoyt Trail, where I talk actually more about who Minerva Hoyt was. Very interesting, make sure you check that video out. Now, Black Rock Canyon Trail. This is really a trail that starts at the Black Rock Campground. So if you wanna learn more about the campground, make sure you watch the full vlog that I put out. So Black Rock Canyon Trail, three miles, elevation gain, 400 feet, route type is an out and back. So there's two really important things you have to learn about this. This is more for people that are staying at the campground. You can show up and hike this, although it, it makes more sense if you're staying on a campsite and you wanna do some hikes at Joshua Tree that you tackle this one as a connecting trail, which I'll talk about in a second. Um, there's really two main ways to access this trail, but again, all of them from the Black Rock Campground sites. If you are planning on coming here and doing these hikes, just know that it is not through the actual entrance of Joshua Tree, so you don't have to pay the fee. Make sure you watch that full vlog, I explain a little bit more about that. All right, so the second point here, which is the biggest point about this, uh, this trail, is that it's really a connecting trail. So we did it as a family at the end of the day to get out, enjoy the Joshua Tree landscape a bit, but, the main reason people access this trail are for the longer ones. So you can see on the map here, uh, it stops right there, which is where we did. So there's three different options here, right? You can make this left, and if you're hiking it to the right, to Warren Peak, you can loop around Panorama Loop, or you can head off to the east and visit Eureka Peak and all these other places over here. Each one of these have their trails on all trails. So there's to Warren Peak, there is the Panorama Loop Trail, and then there is Eureka Point. So if you're in the mood for longer hikes, make sure you check those out. Again, for us, end the day, quick hike in, three miles was perfect. Make sure you check out my Joshua Tree National Park playlist. Lots of cool stuff on there and more trails coming soon. So stay tuned. 